this bitch kicking all the shit all over the place. All the extra crap coming at you. Big on it! That a motherfucker. Echo, echo, echo. Loud as fuck. Got my Evan Williams. Hello, you got Evan Williams! It's Friday night. It's fucking snowing like a motherfucker outside. I got facial hair that just won't quit. Hey, it just did it on its own. I think you had it on the, uh, you got it in the motion part. Yeah, because it turned off on the other side. Yeah, it's supposed to. Anyways. Ah. So, this is going to be the last video for the night. So, you know, I'm already drunk. But look at this shit. The ghost sun. Chill. This is a portable cooler that uses no ice because it's basically a little fridge that uh, is powered by solar powered, I guess, um, and a lithium ion battery. It's got a real compressor, just like a fridge would have. Uh, and I don't know, it's just, it's just fucking gigantic. I wish I could, all right, I'm just gonna open it up. Uh, oh, I just wanna test it out, you know, make sure it works. This was not cheap, by the way. Uh, but I figure, you know, like when I go to Costco, I get like, Meat. Switch it to the other one. The third one? The, the one that says two, I think. No, there's only one and two. Oh, yeah. So, when I go to Costco, sometimes, like, I go to the far one, and then I drive, and it's, like, July, and it's hot, and my trunk is hot, and then all this cheese starts melting, and <laughs> the meat starts cooking already. So, if anything, I mean, aside from, like, let's say I go camping, or let's say I... Yeah, I'm not gonna go camping, but like, let's say for whatever reason, I'm tailgating, right? Or, you know, I'm barbecuing outside or something like that. Uh, yeah, let me show you. Uh, I'll just you know, take it out and we'll see it. Um, you know, it's nice to have a cooler that doesn't use ice because who wants to pay for ice? You know, it's like, that's almost free. It's like water, you know? It's like, who pays for, well, I pay for water, but. Yeah, sucker. Well, either way, oh, look at this bitch. Ugh. Look how big this fucking thing is. I don't know how many quarts this cooler is. <laughs> Maybe 40. I don't know if it even says it or not. 40 liters, that's what it says. Uh, the net weight is 13 kilograms, so the, what is that, like 30 pounds? It's a uh, light gray, and uh, but it's a solar fridge. That's basically what it, what it is. So it comes with like a, uh, like a little, hold on. Comes with like a, uh, like a little solar panel and you know, that charges the battery. And there's like a lithium ion battery somewhere in here that you can like probably disconnect or, I don't know, what the fuck I'm doing here? Notice. There it is. Look at that shit. Humongous. So tie down, it's got a bottle opener, you know? That was well worth the money, right, guys? Guys, hello? All right. Yes. Oh, all right. Lemon and Megas. All right, so let me take that piece of plastic off. I'm gonna take this little plastic off. Got me. Uh, so it comes with like a little, you know, handle and, and like, oh, oh, a big handle, actually. And then like little uh, wheels. And it's got like two pouches, I guess, for the batteries if you wanna keep buying more batteries, you know. Uh, how this open? So it comes with a DC 12 volt uh, thingy too. If you want to plug it in, but uh, the compressor is like right here. And uh, I don't know how to open this. Just oh, ham fisted. And there's a bunch of shit inside. And uh, hold on, let me uh, put this on the ground real quick. Go. I don't want to drop it all crazy. So let's see here. The Solar Flex 30, it comes, I guess, like a solar panel. So when the sun is shining bright, like a diamond. Uh, I know, right? Uh, what is this? So this, you can like unfurl it, and then bam, sunshine powers the cooler, I guess, right? These are little shits. I don't know if it's gonna work right now. There's no sun in here. There's barely light. But uh, what is this? 
I think it's USB powered. I don't know. Uh, let me let me turn this on. I guess I don't know. Can I? Oh, it's got a little drain at the bottom. That's pretty cool. In case you uh, need a drain. This is the power bank. So this is like the the heart and soul of it. The blood, the the blood. Power. It's the power. Ah uh, shit. Uh, this is uh, so high capacity and goes on. I don't know. Built-in LED flashlight, warning light, 15 amp cigarette lighter output, three USB outputs, and it's a 12 volt, 12 amp hour, 144 watt hour capacity, lithium ion battery, made in China. So when my house catches on fire because of this thing, I know, I know what to do. Comes with a little AC adapter, and this is the power bank right here, and a nice, cut out foam uh, thing here. And uh, again, I backed this up on like um, Indiegogo or something like that. It was not cheap at all. Super expensive. But I figured there's a lot of coolers out there for like a couple hundred bucks. I might as well get a good one that doesn't use ice, you know, because yeah. So, all right, battery comes wrapped in plastic and it says go sun. I don't know how, where I'm gonna put this. Where does I thought it like inserts somewhere? Pause. Uh, let's see. Let's test it out. It's got four lights. Can you see that? Three lights. So it's half charged. Comes to you half charged. I don't know how to use this. I don't know what I'm doing here. What is this? Oh, it's got like this 12 volt cigarette lighter outlet thing. And then it also comes with three USB ports, like it said, and some type of. Maybe an input, yeah. That's an input for the shit. Um, I was running. I better go catch it, huh? No, all right, I'll stop. All right, so this, um, you know, I'm lost as to what I need to do. There's more shit in here too, though. I need to take whatever this is out. And oh my God, there's a lot of cables here. So we got bungee cord. In case I need to jump off of a bridge or something, I don't know. This is the cigarette shits. Oh, that plugs into the shits, all right. Oh, I get it now, okay. Because it did have that little outlet port thing. This is a regular house plug that you could also plug into the shits, right? So if you're like, I don't know, at, in your garage, you can just plug it straight to your wall outlet. And this probably, Probably goes into here. So this will go into the wall, this will go into your cooler, aka fridge. User's guide, we don't do that in this in this household. So let's go ahead and uh, jump right into this shit here. <clears throat> I'm gonna turn this bitch on. Oh, there's a uh, silica gel, which is a desiccant, which will dry you out. If you wanna get dried. Uh, so <clears throat> the the layout is weird because it's not that big of a cooler, hey, but I guess since you're not using ice, you know, it's you're not really losing too much space. You can just put shit directly here. But as you can see, I, I'll, this is the compressor here, and you can't like you can't do anything about that. You can just but there's a lot of kind of a lot of storage, I guess, mostly for like. Three or four people at, at best. I don't know how many beers or whatever this could hold or or meats. It's got a little drain plug, like I said, in here somewhere. I don't know, maybe if you spill a bunch of shit, it'll just, and you can see it goes right through. Yeah, it's heavy, but I can see you, so you could probably see the hole, no? Maybe the other way. Yeah, see that little, and then this goes in there. So you spill a bunch of fucking liquid in there, or let's say you do put ice in there for whatever stupid reason, you could drain it. All right. So let's turn it on. I'm gonna turn it on. Oh, Mr. Man, you're quite good at turning me on. <clears throat> All right, so I don't know, this has, this has to be plugged in. I'm assuming this is gonna go, like I said, into the 12 volt 
power source thing here. Yeah, and then I'm gonna plug this. You see how it's as lit as fuck. Uh, I'm gonna plug this into the side of the shit here, which I mean you're not looking at it. Oh, <clears throat> there it is. What happened? Something's going on here. So I'm gonna. Okay. So I mean, I don't know if you could see that. I'm gonna try to show it here. I mean, I can hear the compressor. You hear? It? I almost dropped the whole shit. All right, pretty cool so far. I think. It gets so much lighter each time you pick it up, too. That's <coughs> All right, so. Right here, let's show you. Turn that on. What did I do? Something wrong here. I took that out. There you go. There it is. 64 degrees. Yeah. So you could... Oh, no. 33 degrees. Oh, you could lower it. 29. It goes all the way down to... Damn. Wow, it goes all the way down to negative four degrees. Can you see that? Uh, what is it, settings? Eco, max. So I want max settings and I want yeah, max settings. And it's got a USB port right here. I don't know for what, maybe power. But uh, so this is gonna be, what is it? Negative something degree, negative four degrees. Just ruined the whole shit. Fuck your face. I know. It's not cheap. <clears throat> and then <clears throat> I can like, you know, on a nice sunny day, I could break out the solar shits. And, uh, I think, um, oh, okay. So I'll plug this from the solar shits, right? Speaking of solar shits. I can plug this here into the battery backup thing, backup battery thingy. And... And plug it in there it is like that so that's cool there's no sun in here but and then I don't know like how am I gonna test that this even has reached the temperature that I'm desiring I'm just gonna stick my hand in here and see if it's cold I don't know. oh give me my temperature gun from the kitchen so right now it's 59 degrees, right? And I'm trying to bring it down to negative four. So let's see how long this takes. I think it's pretty cool. I don't know. That's just me though. Uh, there's a sniper in the building somewhere. 13 minutes, you're killing the battery? 86 degrees, that's me right here. Let's see how much this is. Does this have this? This needs like a rubber pad. Okay, so it's 59 degrees. It claims we started, I think, at like 63. 72 degrees in there. I don't know where it's getting its information from. Flex 30. There's also a table that they sell that you could just kind of like put it shit and then plug it in. I thought the battery would have like some type of com other than the bags in the back. But uh, I forget what temperature I said it was. 70 something? Let's see now. Drop down to 70. 
don't know if you can see that. 70. All right, so we'll give it another few minutes. Uh, I mean, we got all types of time. It's 15 minutes in. It's like the shortest video I've ever done in my life. Ever. I'm getting drunker by the millisecond. <clears throat> Evan Williams, I love you, God. <clears throat> Let's see. Oh, the battery's at one bar right now. <clears throat> so I gotta figure out a way to uh, charge it better. Maybe I should have started with a full charge, but then I wouldn't, because I unboxed it, so I don't know. <clears throat> I guess within time, I'll let you know. There we go again, on my own. <laughs> Walking down the only road I've ever known. <clears throat> uh, let's see here. I don't know. I'll charge it. I'll charge this lithium ion battery, which, uh, I think it's in the meantime is the the shit solar cooler battery power I was wondering why my stomach was burning it's the hot sauce that's like right here the one that fell? yeah the, the one that spilled all over me thanks Tom Mata no well thanks post office but come on Tom you know you, you know you should know better but all right, uh, let's see. Do not use blah, 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 something about shits. Eh, you gotta do the shit with the shit. Troubleshooting, it's not cooling down. The food inside is frozen. This can actually freeze food. That's pretty cool. Uh, all right, well, whatever. Let's see how, if it dropped below, what did I say it was earlier? I don't remember. Sixty-eight point. Uh, what does it say? 68.3. So it's getting there. I don't know how long it takes to reach the maximum cool temperature. Ugh, it burns. But uh, I don't know. I should put a water in there or something. It might take a while. I don't know. But anyways, it's a fucking solar cooler. You know, like you could charge it with the sun you can just leave the shit here like open like that and it's gonna it's gonna charge the battery and then with that battery you could have a cooler that doesn't need ice or like a little mini fridge basically it's like a fridge it's basically a fridge who are we kidding here? it's not a cooler it's a fridge although it is an insulated fridge which most you know so this is a portable flexible 30 watt solar charger says any USB chargeable device, five volts up to two amps, charging the Go Sun Power Bank Plus. Other products can utilize unregulated solar power. Uh, it says thank you for choosing Go Sun. Da, da, da. It says solar panel. It provides up to two amps, I guess. Uh, don't don't put your shit on it, I guess. I don't know. But anyways, I'm going to put this shit right back where it belongs. <clears throat> I don't have any sun to test that out with. You know, so, it's 18 minutes. All right, let's do a final reading, and then I'm just going to end the video at like 20 minutes, because it's already 19 minutes right now. So, uh, it was 68.3 earlier. My stomach burns. 67.1 so it is cooling off a of battery no ice and it's supposed to get down to Sorry. it's supposed to get down to negative four degrees so that's pretty cool i'm gonna let it do its thing and maybe i'll splice in a little extra video if not which i probably won't do it uh, so a quick update I'm gonna put a uh, room temperature bottle of water, as you can see here. 75 degrees, right? I'm gonna put it inside the cooler, which is, at the moment, 63 degrees. And 
Okay, it, it's it's cool in there actually. Hey, it feels cool in there. All right, uh, it is. Hold on. Yeah, there we go. 8.38 p.m. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, boy. Let me see. Maybe I'll... There it is. 8.38 p.m. Uh, I'm going to put the bottle of water in there. And, again, it's... Well, now it's 68 degrees because it's probably because I put the bottle of water in there. No, no, 62. There we go, 62 degrees. Uh, 8.38 p.m. And I want to see just how long it takes for the bottle to freeze from room temperature, I guess. So we'll see. Uh, I'll keep you updated. What am I? Uh, I mean, uh, all right, so it's uh, 9.20. And I want to see, it says zero degrees Fahrenheit on the shit. Uh, let me just test it out. Uh, I don't know if you can see it. 19 degrees. And let's see how much the water bottle temperature is. 62 degrees. Can you see that? 62 degrees so it, it dropped it like I don't know 10 something degrees it's getting to negative one but it, it seems like it's working fine I'm gonna update it again in a little bit of time so I think if you leave this shit plugged in oh yeah I did change my shirt because that shit was burning and I took the hat off but well, whatever um, so I got some food cooking I'm in about 15 minutes I'm gonna check again to see what the temperature is and uh, we'll see how how much from room temperature how long it takes for this shit to get to like, you know, drinkable, awesome temperature. We'll see. Like I said, 922 right now. Got 10 minutes left. We'll see. All right. I'm pretty pleased to uh, see that it's, I got like one minute left uh, on my timer. It's 931. So it's been like an hour, I guess, of this thing plugged in from room temperature to now. It says it's negative three degrees on the shit. Let's see what it says on the shit. Six degrees. Can you, it's gonna, six degrees. Let's see how much the water is. Room temperature water, it's cold. I could drink this right now. 57 degrees. You can't see it. 57 degrees. Yeah, I know. It's like a fridge. It's, it's, I mean, it's cold. I can feel it. So this works, man. This is a cooler that works on fucking a power bank that can be charged with a solar-powered shit. So, I mean, oh, man, this is pretty fucking cool because, like I said, I can put this in my trunk. My food is ready. I can put this shit in my trunk. I guess I would have to let it cool for like an hour first. Look at the hair though, man. Unbelievable. All right, so uh, I'd have to let it cool for like an hour first. On the way to the shit, you know? The, plug the battery in. By the time I get to, the, you know, Costco or wherever, I can feel it. It's cold right now. Look, this is... Uh, 71 degrees. Well, let's see. 93 degrees. Can you see anything? No. All right. And then let's see what's in here. Oh, look. It says negative four. That's what. Can you see? Negative four degrees. So the, the cooler itself is negative four degrees. That's insane. So it could freeze anything that you really want, and it's it's battery backup. I mean, can you go wrong with this? It's cold in here. It is cold in there. The water's gonna take a while to freeze, but like you know, <sighs> give it another twenty minutes, and I bet that water's gonna be frozen. I don't know. Should I wait? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I should do. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna I'm gonna go eat my food, 
I'm gonna let this do its thing. I wanna see if that water freezes. We'll see what happens. That's crazy, negative four degrees. It really does what it says it does. All right, we'll see, we'll see. All right, let's we'll see. All right, so it's uh, 10.05 now. Super drunk, I ain't good. Chinese food leftovers and pizza rolls, that kind of shit. Right now it's uh, 72 degrees in here. You can't see it. 92.3 degrees. However, in the cooler, Eight degrees, so it went up. However, the water shit, 44 degrees. I'm gonna drink it. Uh, perfectly refrigerated water, 46 degrees. Can you see it? degrees so but in here in the shit it's four degrees <clears throat> uh, it says negative one earlier was negative shit but uh, that's some good water it's not negative I mean it's not like 20 30 degrees but but Look, man, it's doing its thing. It's like pretty consistently like six degrees though, you know? So uh, it's really cold in there. This compressor works. Yeah, I mean, you can't go wrong, man. It's a cooler. But anyways, it works. I'm pretty happy about it, I guess. I don't know. It's a lot of money, though. When am I going to use it? But I'm going to still use it one of these days. And I'm too drunk to contemplate whatever bullshit. But anyway, thank you for watching. And peace out. See ya. Thank you for watching. And peace out! Thanks for watching all my crazy-ass videos with me with a fro and facial hair. I'll be back to normal one of these days. It's just not going to be now, so... Thank you for watching.